go fresh than five let's go lots of people having fun Oh, hi, I was just observing these posters here. Uh, outside venue. Um, yes. <laughs> hi, my name is Alexander Lilly, and I will be giving you your campus tour, Freshers 2016. Let's go on, I'll get, take you, give you a nice little tour around. So, as I said, this is venue. This will be your local nightclub around on campus, where we're having such events such as soap and the lovely Freshers Ball, which will be like Las Vegas themed. Now, let's go and find somewhere else we can have some fun. Come on, let's go. So here we have Essentials. This is a fantastic place to get all your goods, your food, all the snacks needed for your times and studies, and halfway through your lectures. And yeah, this is the place you get all your essential foods. Let's go. <laughs> so here is this is job shop. This is be a, this is be the key place for you to go if you're looking for some part time work. Right here, they'll show some vacancies for any part time jobs around, whether on campus or down in Canterbury City Centre. These people here are also fantastic at helping you create a CV or creating a really good job application for whatever job you need to. Just get that little bit of extra money to help you with your with your um, studies. So let's go find some more stuff. <laughs> this is Blackwell's. This is your bookshop. Um, this will find all your all the latest and most essential books that you need for your studies. You'll find a variety of different genres, and this will be a fantastic place for finding both new and used books here at a reasonable price for your studies. And also, just opposite Blackwell's, we have cost, uh, we have. Cafe Nero, which would be your fantastic, lovely getaway from after all your stressful days at studying. You sit down, have a lovely coffee with your friends. What more can you want? So this is the first college we'll be looking at, Elliot College, also known as a complete and utter maze on campus. Um, that is twinned with Rutherford and you'll find that you have lovely new le uh, lecture theatres, you have some seminar rooms, some IT rooms and a great and of course in Elliot we have Mungos. Let's go and see what they're up to, let's go. Thankfully I know my way around Elliot, well just about. <laughs> Come down here and we'll find us a final So here we are, Mungo's. You'll find that this place has excellent quality food at a very decent price. You'll find that there are also much different events here going on, such as Massive Mungo's or my personal favourite, Monkey Shine, the local comedy club. Absolutely fantastic. Now, we're done with that here. Let's go find somewhere else to have fun. It's so good that there are maps around campus because I still get lost sometimes. Oh. oh, it's this way. So this here is quite an important part of the university because this is where you're doing most of your banking. You have here the banking portals. So I find that this is your NatWest X spot. And then moving on over here, we have Campus Watch. This will be the place where you'll find any lost items or if you have any troubles campus watch is the place that you need to go whether that's an emergency or you know if you want to have a chat have a nice down cup of tea i'm sure they'd love that <laughs> right and on over here we have the student learning advisory center we're here they are they're here they will help you with all your needs in terms of learning your studies of course not everyone's going to have them full smooth time with their studies so these guys they will help you make it go as smoothly as possible you know? next to that is Santander the next bank around on campus where you get where you can do all your lovely jobby bunking all right on with the tour so you join me here outside the Temple Library possibly with the 
most important place on this whole campus because this is where you'll be spending most of your time as a student as there are thousands of books around inside the library that help you with your course. And also, best thing about it, it's open 24 hours. What more can you want? I have to say, hear you say, there is a cafe inside that will do you some nice food for those long nights spending <laughs> doing your studies. You will also find IT computers that you can use to look up anywhere, anything online to help you with your studies. And there's also some few quiet zones if you feel like you want to study in peace. So this here is the Senate building. This is where you're going to be doing all your private studies, if you want to of course. And also if you feel like you want to get out and do some studying alone, maybe some peace and quiet, there's a big computer room up there equipped with lovely computers and printers all your studies where you need. And this, this here is Rutherford, the next college on our list, on our tour. And just like Elliot, it's pretty much a labyrinth, but you're not going to find David Bowie in there. What you are going to find though, some lecture theatres and seminar rooms and maybe some IT rooms around. You've also got the nice quiet area in there um, where you can do a little bit more studying and stuff. If you are a resident of uh, Rutherford though, you can get your nice B and B out in the big hole. Get some nice breakfast, good food. What more can you want? Just around the corner, we have Tyler Court A, B, and C, which is the student accommodation. And just around, we're going to go to Darwin. We're going to see Darwin a little bit, and then afterwards, we're going to go to the Gold Bank Inn. And yeah, we'll see what you can do. This here, this is Darwin College. Inside here you'll find a few lecture theatres and seminar rooms, but most of all and most importantly you'll find Origins, the other campus bar, well campus. Um, here that is, Origins is a Tex-Mex bar where you'll find different uh, foods such as um, enchiladas, maybe even some chicken, chips, you know, you name it, it's really good food. And you've also got Ruby Tuesdays happen there on a Tuesday and you've got karaoke on a Saturday. If any of you have hearts of goals and voices like angels, go on on a Saturday evening. Come bring a few friends, have a few drinks. Believe me, it is a fantastic night. You'll have so much fun. Here it is, the Golbenkium, a famous place on Canterbury. Not as famous as the Marlowe Theatre, but it's getting there. Here you'll find the Golbenkium Theatre for all our drama students and stuff, for doing their productions. And we also have the Golbenkium Cinema, where you can do, you can see all the latest films out, and also maybe even have an action theatre in there. Who knows? Golbenkium is also connected to the Cornwallis Building, which is the home of the, computer, the School of Computing. So here we have Woody's, this is the local bar and restaurant within Parkwood. If you're a resident in Parkwood, well, this is the place you, get, you want to go to. If you want to eat a few great meals, have a few drinks with your friends, come right here, have some fun. This is our final stop on our campus tour, Keynes College. Here you'll find a few lecture theatres, seminar rooms and some IT suites. There are also two fantastic places you can go to hang out with your friend. We've got the Dolce Vita, which is a lovely cafe that serves fantastic food. We've also got K-Bar, which you can sit down in an evening, have a few drinks with your mates, and just have some fun. I have been having a wonderful time here, showing you around campus, and I hope you find that this year you can get around quite easily. But if there is the off chance that you still don't know where you're going and you're in a rush to get to your lectures or seminars, don't know where it is, if you look at your timetable, it will show you the link to the what room that you are in and it will also show you the directions for how to get there. I've been Alexander Lilly, I hope you had some fun and I hope you've learned a few things. I'll see you next time.